Brexiteer lists five tests for Boris's imminent Brexit deal and warns PM, will be toast. A Brexiteer has listed five key tests for Boris Johnson's imminent Brexit deal with the EU, and has given the Prime Minister a stern warning about selling out UK interests. Former Brexit Party MEP Jake Pugh has come up with the five tests for Brexiteers to analyse the 2,000 pages of the Brexit deal, which is expected to be announced tonight. He warned the treaty must pass the tests, or Boris Johnson, will be toast. Mr Pugh told Express.co.uk the five tests are, 1. To what extent is the freedom to diverge allowed by LPF, level playing field? 2. Is Northern Ireland still carved off from Great Britain? 3. Terms of fish access and length of duration. 4. What has been agreed on services? 5. Terms of any cross-retaliation. The Brexiteer then issued a stark warning to the Prime Minister and said he was concerned the Brexit deal will be rushed through Parliament without scrutiny. He said, also, very concerned that such a critical international treaty is rushed through just before Christmas and with close to zero scrutiny. But beware, if Boris has caved, Brexiteers will spot it and he will be toast. The UK and Brussels are set to announce the details of a post-Brexit deal either tonight or tomorrow as the two sides are believed to have compromised on the three major sticking points. A French official has told Reuters Britain has caved on its fishing demands. They said, the British made huge concessions, in the last 24 hours. There has been no official confirmation from either side that a deal was about to be struck. A source at the European Commission said talks were still underway, though now in their final stages, and one EU official urged caution, saying, it could still go either way. A British government source was also cautious and said, negotiations are ongoing. However, three diplomatic sources in the bloc told Reuters that member states had started to prepare their procedure to implement any deal from January 1, if one was agreed. Sterling jumped more than 1.1% against the dollar on perceived prospects of a deal while bond yields rose, and prices fell, in Britain, Europe and the United States.